car manufacturers is looking for a set of business in the US market they need to know the factors on which the pricing of a car depend on to take on their competition in the market the company wants to know the variables the price depends on a and to what extent does the variable explain the price of a car so welcome back programmers in the today's section we are gonna predict the price of the car so in the today's section we are gonna build a model for the price of a car as a function of explanatory variable the company will then use it to configure the price of a car according to its feature or configure the features according to its price so let's begin so I just imported all of the library which I need in this video and then I just use the car.csv file link is in the description and I use panda to read csv so in this csv you can see all of the data in here we got car name we got year we got selling price we got present year sorry we got present price we got kilometers driven we got fuel type we got seller type we got transmission and we got owner we don't need all of the data we are gonna just use the selling price present price kilometers driven and that's it you can see here just I just cater the kilometers driven and the selling price in here if kilometer driven is if kilometer driven is more then the selling price is low okay if KMS driven is more then selling price is gonna be decreasing and I just created X and Y X equal to features which is present price and the kilometers driven even you can add fuel type and so on so but I just add only two features and y equal to selling price okay now let's split this data and we are gonna use SQL and dot model selection import train test split so you can see in here I just created the x train x test y train and y test so all of this data in here you can see x train x test y train and y test and you can even see the shape of the x train is 240 and x test is 61 again y train is 240 and y test is 61 okay now let's create model equal to linear regression which i used to scale and dot linear model import linear regression so this is our model and let's just create the prediction of the x train and let's find out the predicted y so predicted y equal to model but first let's fit the data model dot fit I just fed the x train and the y train in here you can see the linear regression now let's use the model dot predict function and let's pass the x train sorry x test in here so we can predict the predicted y so you can see we successfully created our predicted y and the predicted y is this so that's how you can find the predicted y let's remove this and you can see we got just like this output now let's find out the score so you can see in here the first y test it means selling price is 3.75 and the predicted price is 4.39 I know it's not a good model but it's kind of close you know and the second one is 11 the third one is 1.063 and you can see the fourth one is kind of correct you can see 0.45 and the last one is 3.06 so it predicts the value of car but if we use the tensorflow for predict this model you can see the actual accurate answer but we just use the linear regression model from SKLN so this is not good but kind of good model so that's how you can predict the car price using the SKLN you can see your predicted and actual XY in here so this is our plotted X test and predicted Y and X train and Y train now let's try X train and Y train test in here so that's our plotted model in here so that's how you can predict the car price using the linear regression comment me if you wanna know how to predict the car price using the tensorflow so that is it for today's guys this is the short video of how to predict the car price using the SKLN all of this code is gonna available in my all-in-one code.pythonanyway.com site so just check out that site
right now so this is it for today guys see you guys in the next video till then like my video and hit on the bell icon and subscribe my channel see you guys in the next video thank you